In this short but informative video, we shall learn what are fat cells or adipocytes, difference between white fat and brown fat, difference between fat cells of a smart person and an obese person, structure location and number of adipocytes in children and adults, functions and chemistry of fat cells, why women have more fat than men and many more. Fat cells, biologically they are called as adipocytes. The body tissue having most adipocytes is termed as adipose tissue because other tissues are also present within. Cytoplasm and nucleus of these fat cells is actually pushed along plasma membrane because of the presence of a single large globule of fat in the center. Fat cells may occur singly, individually or in different clusters in different locations of the body. They have single large globule of triglycerides. Remember the term triglyceride. Blood vessels and areolar tissues are also present within these clusters. Now cell size may range from 70 to 120 micrometer in diameter but in obese person that size may increase up to 5 times. Glycerides are continuously being stored and they are continuously being used depending upon the need and availability. They are present under skin, breast, heart surface, mesenteries, kidney, around kidneys and in eyes. White fat. White fat is most abundant fat in adults. Fat cells have single large central globule of triglycerides. When stained with different dyes during staining, cell appear empty due to dissolution of triglycerides with stains. Actually, these stains uh, uh, dissolve that uh, uh, triglyceride uh, and uh, it is not stained actually and it is not seen in the uh, microscope. Cells are oval individually but when they are packed, their shape becomes polygonal. Globule consists of glycerol esters of oleic, palmitic and stearic acids. Remember these acids. Mitochondria and endoplasmic reticulum are without membrane case. That is another exception. There is no membrane around mitochondria and EPR and they are in direct contact with the cytoplasm. Brown fat. Brown fat cells are found mostly in infants and children about 6% of body weight when they are born. Brown fat pads are present in shoulders, upper back and kidneys of the children or infants. Multiple globules are present in single cell. Please note the difference. Brown color is due to enormous blood vessels and some enzymes in the mitochondria which depart brownish color to the brown fat. Mitochondria are numerous with large cystae that is another exception as well and numerous mitochondria but pathway is not linked to ATP synthesis their function is different. Adult humans do not have brown fat but mitochondrial UCP1 is seen. UCP1 means uncoupled protein and that protein actually helps to uh, uncouple the pathway toward ATP and that also shows that if adult humans take brown fat, that brown fat can be used to gain energy. Now, functional comparison between white and brown fat. Both types provide energy storage, both types provide insulation and both types provide protection and cushion to organs. Now, white fat provides shape by filling space like in breast. White fat supplies chemical energy during fasting and cell size reduces. Brown fat does not provide chemical energy but only heat. That's the major difference between white fat and brown fat. And that's why it is stored in hibernating animals during winter. Now slim versus obese people. Number of fat cells remain constant. That's the term. That's the main theme of uh, this slide. Number of fat cells remain constant during adulthood. Slim people have smaller size fat cells while obese people have larger sized fat cells due to over accumulation of glycerides resulting in large globules and that is the reason behind obesity. Now taking less fats and fasting results in reduction of size of fat cells and it is the one way to reduce weight. Why women have more fats? 
Women have more fat naturally because she need more calories during pregnancy as well as she has to nourish the infant by feeding milk after birth and that requires energy. Having too little fat reduces female fertility. Keep in mind. Thank you.